and flames destroy one McLean County family's home. But after years of giving back to the community, new tonight, Gan Matthews explains it's this family's time to receive. It was really nice. After living here for 24 years, the last thing Richard Madden was expecting was that his house would burn down. I've always heard, you know, it's just like, I guess you could say like butchering a hog. Once you get the outside, insides, and you just lose it all. It is a total loss. The house that was home to Madden, his wife, and eight children. All of my kids grow up here and all, so I mean, this is this was part of our life. And then, I mean, it's just shattered. <laughs> Few men could laugh after losing their homes. But then you don't know Richard Madden and his wife. His sister does. The good people. They're, they're givers. Um, they're doers. They're survivors. Yes, Richard Madden has given a lot to his community. A few years ago, he helped build a home for a woman in Washington. Now the community is giving back to him. I got friends out there I didn't even know I had. <laughs> And I mean, people's coming out of the woodworks and all, offering things, giving things. Uh, Saturday night, I couldn't even get it all in my icebox with all the food at the churches and people around here brought. The Maddens are living temporarily in a mobile home and they're looking for a rental house in Purcell. But in time, they plan to rebuild their home on the land they love near the town that loves them. In Washington, Gan Matthews, News 9. And fortunately, the Maddens had their home insurance.